Hey YouTube, it's Marquita. Welcome to week 28 of my pregnancy. Today I am 28 weeks and 6 days pregnant. And so Wednesday I will be 29 weeks. Yay! Um, so this video or this week's update is actually in two parts. Um, it'll be this update about like how the week was and then there'll be an extended update about how my three week I, my three hour uh, glucose tolerance test went and the results of that. I'll t speak a little bit on it in this video, but um, because there's so much involved in it, I put it in a whole separate video, which still ended up taking me like 12 minutes to film. So, um, yeah. And sorry if it's noisy for some reason. Seattle has decided to finally, spring has sprung. And um, those of you who don't live in the Pacific Northwest probably know nothing of this, but we do not have central air conditioning in these parts. Um, our spring and summers are so short that we don't ever need them. So we have heat in our homes, but we don't have air conditioning. So we, our houses are cooled by the, the windows being open. So my windows are open and so there's traffic going by the house. So um, sorry if it gets a little noisy. Okay, so let's jump right into the video. So for this week, my symptoms have pretty much been the same. Um, frequent urination, heartburn, not able to breathe. My pelvis is still killing me. Um, what else? Still mild swelling. Um, and that's really it. Like everything has pretty much been the same. Um, as far as the baby, she's still moving around, not as much, but they said that that's to be expected because I'm my third and final trimester. Yay! So, um, she, like, needs to, like, store up fat and other things like that. So, um, their movements, I guess, kind of, like, decline in the third trimester. And not to mention that I'm just, like, really running out of room. So, um, movement is decreased in the third trimester. Uh, but apparently from what I've been reading, she can now like blink her eyes, which is crazy to think that a baby can open up their eyes in water or amniotic fluid and like, they can't really see anything, but they can see like the flecks of light that come in through my skin. Um, so I try to like give her some like stomach time, you know, try to let her get some sun or some light, uh, to help with that. And, um, what else? She's now making like small breathing movements with the amniotic fluid, so that's pretty cool. Um, and they say that if she was to be born right now, that she could survive with little metal, medical intervention. She would just need, to, of course, to bulk up. So we don't have any plans of that, but um, it's good to know that we're like really, it's like a full baby is growing and that we're getting closer to full term. Um, just to touch on the three hour test, because I recorded that one first, but I'm going to upload it after this one. Um, I realized that I left out a few things. So once you watch that video, you'll completely understand more of what I'm talking about. But now I will only have one due date. Um, I have an ultrasound scheduled for next week with my new provider, and they will be doing a baseline. But for right now, I am 28 weeks and in, in six days. <laughs> Unless that ultrasound says something different, that baby's bigger or smaller, and they change my due date. Um, but I only have, I'm back to having one due date. And um, I now go and see my physician once a week. So um, every week I'll have an update about what happened at the doctor. I had a doctor's appointment today, and the baby was measuring right at 29 weeks. So she's just a few days ahead, so it's great. Um, heart tones are great. Everything is doing great everything's looking good so um what else there's only like so much I can say without getting into a ramble about the three hour glucose test so really go watch that video <laughs> it would really defeat the purpose to like redo the whole video here um that's really it and that's like oh wow it's a five minute update but so much of the other update is in the other video, and I was afraid that if I like recorded them together, that I have like a 20 minute video, and some people do that, but I don't really, like, when I have 16 minute videos, I cringe, because I'm like, ugh, who wants to watch a 16 minute video of me talking? 
So anyway, um, yeah, we are based on my new position. We are now I'm 28, almost 29. So roughly seven between seven and nine weeks away from a baby being here which is crazy and I will definitely talk more about that next week once I meet with the doctor and once we have like a general game plan we don't have a game plan yet so I don't really have anything that's in concrete um, but yeah that's really about it of an update I know it's a really crappy update I'm not feeling the best, and if you watch the other video, you'll know why I feel like caca. <laughs> um, but yeah. So, anyway, if something different pops up or something new pops up in the next couple of days, then I will definitely give you guys another update. If not, then I'll give you guys an update on Tuesday of next week. Um, probably, or I'm, I might change the, day, the days that I do my videos. Um, sorry. I might change the days that I do my videos only because there's really no point in doing a video at the end of my week. So I'm like doing a video at 28 weeks and 6 days. It really doesn't make any sense. So, um, I might change the days that I do my videos only. So, I don't know. But, um, yeah. I'll be in to do an update. And I'll put my link to Facebook. Like I said, Facebook is... If I can't update on the video, that's the best place to find me is on Facebook, and we're there under Mom and Mommy. So yeah, baby deaths to all that need it, and um, everyone who's newly pregnant, uh, a big shout out to Lesbian Family Diary. Uh, they have been trying uh, just as long, if not maybe longer than we have to conceive, and they are... Um, pregnant so that's super exciting I can't wait to see some more footage and uh, hear your beta numbers so yay and uh, anyone else who's recently pregnant I'm sorry I've really been off of Facebook the past I mean off of YouTube this past week so um, congrats to anybody else out there anyone who's had their babies congrats and for those of you I am now included in that bubble if you're having a difficult time it gets better I have to keep telling myself that, but things are going to get better, and they're not all awful, so, yeah, that's going to be it for the week, sorry, it's a crappy update, um, check out the other video, and I will talk to you guys in a couple days, or next week, thanks, bye.